At sea, in the air and on land, Lockheed Martin is developing laser weapon systems ready to defend US and allied forces. Combined with our platform integration expertise, these systems are designed to defeat a growing number of threats to military forces and infrastructure across all domains. As a much cheaper alternative for neutralizing enemy rockets and drones compared to the interceptor missiles it currently uses. The system, a prototype of which was unveiled last year, uses lasers to heat and disable airborne threats. Lockheed Martin announced plans to upgrade its current laser technology to 500 kilowatt class lasers. This would be a major increase in output over existing 300 kilowatts lasers, and would be more powerful than any laser weapon being developed or developed today. The weapon will result in lower costs per shot fired and destruction of objects. Lasers are primarily a defensive tool. High-powered light is used to melt and disable drones, mortars, rockets and other projectiles. Many of these targets are small, such as quadcopters or simple rockets, and can be neutralized as threats by disabling the rotor members or guidance fins. A laser with 500 kilowatts of energy would be very powerful. This drone can take down a quadcopter in just 8 seconds. Used by Pop Psy, it took 15 seconds to stop the same type of drone. The 500 kilowatt laser under development is 50 times the same energy concentrated into a single beam, which would likely melt a drone in a fraction of a second. The US Army has selected Lockheed's 300 kW laser to mount on armored vehicles and protect formations from rocket attacks. The 500 kW laser will combine the successes of the 300 kW system and lessons learned from legacy programs to further prove the capability to defend against a wide range of threats. Lockheed is developing the 500 kW laser as part of the High Energy Laser Scaling Initiative, a Pentagon program to develop lasers in the 300, 500, and 1000 kW power ranges. Big investment. Intended to counter enemy drone, artillery and rocket attacks, the 300 kW class laser weapon should also be capable of damaging helicopters and fixed-wing aircraft. A minimum output power of 100 kW is generally considered necessary for a laser weapon to be able to shoot down mortars and small drones at considerable distances. LAWS uses infrared beams from a solid-state laser array that can be set to high output to destroy targets or low output to warn or disable target sensors. By positioning key points, LAWS can shoot down small UAVs in just two seconds.